This is the video where I'm going to walk you through step by step on the things we talked about. Setting up your host, which in this case I recommend Bluehost. That's what I use and what I'm used to. And then getting our WordPress, our domain chosen and our WordPress installed. So just to show you, I'm going to use this handy timer, set it to seven minutes so that you do indeed see that uh, it is going to be a seven minute setup. And so we're going to set this and start. And then I'm going to go over and start going to Bluehost. So artistsmith.com slash Bluehost. That's my affiliate link I have there on that page. If you use that, I am an affiliate for Bluehost. So that would, I would really appreciate that. And hit get started now. And we'll just select the starter package. That's as low as $349 per month. Here's where we choose our new domain. So you get a domain with your subscription. And for, I'll choose 8bitpaintings.com. I'm going to use this. I'm going to set up a demo site called 8-Bit Paintings. And it is available. So we'll hit next. And then we enter our account information. It, it does say that 8bitpaintings.com is available. So I'm just going to put my name in here and uh, all my information. And I'm going to autofill that with my password program. Now your account plan. So it, it's tiered pricing. So for 36 months, it's as low as $349 a month. It does change a little bit from time to time. Sometimes they do have specials and sales. So we'll do, do the 12 month price for $495 per month. And for this, for the purposes of this demonstration, and then we need to put in our billing info. So I'm not going to let you actually see that, unfortunately. So I'm going to put in my billing information. I'm going to autofill that. And then we've got our terms of service and all of that stuff. I'm sure you will read that to a T as I have. <laughs> so then we'll hit next and it's going to do some thinking and processing and it's going to show us some upgrades, but we don't need any of that. Just scroll down to the bottom and say complete, hit the complete button. So the purchase was successful and it's going to send you a confirmation email. And then you're going to be prompted to set up to create your password. Uh, just be sure you create a strong password. It's going to create one for you if you want it to. And then uh, also you can, you need to be sure to confirm again that you've read the terms of service or it will not proceed. So we're going to say create so that we'll approve that password. All right, now we're going to go back to our email. I'm going to go to my email and it takes a little while for it to arrive. You're going to get an email from Bluehost with your domain. And this is the welcome email. It has your uh, link to update your password, your domain, your username. Uh, your So just go back to the uh, login for WordPress, for, I'm sorry, Bluehost. Type in your domain or your username and your password. It popped in that other password, that other username because that's another username that I use with Bluehost but uh, I'm creating a brand new fresh install for you just so you can see it. So this is what's called the C panel and it's going to bring us here and we're going to go down to this little icon that says install WordPress because we want to put WordPress on our domain. Go down there and install WordPress. Your particular image may not look exactly like this, but it will look something like this. And uh, just leave all of that at defaults. It's going to tell you, uncheck the plugins and themes. We don't really need those. Again, check the checkbox and continue. So it's going to be installing WordPress now on our domain. And uh, just tell it to override existing files. If there are existing files, there probably aren't, but there are no existing files. So then it's going to give you a little URL. Then you click uh, your welcome email. 
And as you can see, that pretty much does it. So we have installed WordPress on our new domain. So in that short seven minute video, I walked you through getting your account set up. I showed you how to choose your domain, how to then put in your information, your billing information, and then how to install WordPress using the little install WordPress icon. And then it gives you a login for your special WordPress installation on your site. So hopefully that uh, made some sense to you and you really saw how easy and quick that was and how cost effective it can be. The cost of a cup of coffee uh, at Starbucks <laughs> per month to, uh, to have a website. It's as little as, as that. So next steps, you know, don't let this hold you back. Go ahead and jump in with both feet. And I urge you to take action and just uh, start. It, there's some, nothing more liberating than having the feeling of having your very own self-hosted website and come back here for the next video where we will talk about building your site, uploading your theme, how it's going to look, then some other things that we'll do to the site to get it ready for your portfolio so you can display and sell your artwork.